What is up, maniacs, and welcome back to the channel. I hope y'all are having a great one. Today, we're going to be hopping into the Link Regulation Dual Event, and I will be showing you guys how to climb up the rank, especially if you don't want to use Link Monsters. I will be using this OTK Banky deck, which is basically the only deck that I'm able to use from my 20 decks that I have because everything either was banned, limited, or overall. I can't use because I don't need I don't have the cards that I need to make the deck effective so we're gonna hop in and OTK some brothers but if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe to it for some more awesome gameplay and make sure to slap that like button if you enjoyed the video leave a comment down below letting me know what you guys think of this deck and let me know if you guys are actually using link monsters in this event because your boy has almost no experience with link monsters most of my decks if not all don't use any so i'm not very versed in this area but nonetheless let's hop right into it for the first match of course you want to go second with this deck you definitely want to let them do whatever they think they need to do and order for you to otk them and that is a very weak board oh we could get around that super easy we have mataza and the ben key so no matter what we have plays right here so we're gonna magical mallet get that bad boy and we choose to use the ben key because of the extra attacks with equip spells so we're definitely gonna load them up right away oh yeah power of the guardians extremely broken noble arms and we're just gonna put that face down so we could get more due to mage power we're gonna tag him for 55 Ooh, and then otk my dude direct attacks honestly the thing that takes the longest is their turn as soon as their turn is done you could basically do what you need so nonetheless let's hop right into the next match and for the second match yet again going second sometimes it works going first but it sucks either way all right, let's see what the God Pod desires. Okay, unfortunately, I do not have many equipped cards, so I'm kind of fighting a losing battle here, but I do have Regeki to clear the opponent's board. Okay, so he's going to right away start off by getting a whole bunch of monsters on the field. Okay, cool. I do have the Regeki as long as he does not have a negate. I feel like we'll do pretty well. So he gets the Monk out, links those away. This dude has got plays for days. Okay. Zerker of Tenny. Uh, a link three for 3,000. Okay. Doesn't seem too strong to me. So we're going to go ahead and regeki this. Let's see what happens. Ooh. The whole thing is gone just like that. But he gains 5,000. Are you serious? All right. So we're going to go ahead and attack this dude for 8,600. So now he has a very low life points. We're going to see if he's able to come back. Okay. He gets a field spell. Okay. He pitches that for what reason? To knock my dude down. Okay, cool. And he does the same thing. Okay. But at the end turn, my dude is just as strong as ever. So what are we going to do? We're going to freaking reload just to be cheeky. Just to try to do a little more damage. We're going to get another axe of despair. Ooh, and we're going to attack with the zapper, my guy. GG's. G, G's. This is so fun and cheeky, honestly. It's working very well. I thought it was going to be a little bit harder to move up, but so far it's working very well. So let's hop right in to the next match. So for our third match, yet again, going second. And this time we have a slightly better hand, but still not the best hand. We always like to see either a Ben Key or a Zapper and all equipped cards but we do have stuff to kind of work away around that okay jar of grief he's gonna draw a card and okay hollow life barrier so his opponents can't get destroyed and i can't deal damage okay sick brother so we're gonna go ahead and get rid of that but we're gonna magical mallet the imperm back in to draw one card out and pot of desires sick i'll take that Let's get rid of those and let's see oh the regeki another magical mallet kind of not the best but hey we'll take what we can get okay the sangan okay he's gonna attack me for 2600 i could take it i could take it it's gonna link the sangan away okay 
Okay. The fire bunny robot. Cool. Okay. Oh, he's trying to exodia me. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. So, we're going to go ahead, Rigeki. And he's going to negate it. Of course, that is all fine and dandy. Because we got other plans in mind. Okay, we're going to Magical Mallet, the Imperm, yet again. And then, oh, we get the Psychic Blade. Axe of Despair, the Band Key. Psychic play, Blade, pay 2,000. And then we got Power of the Guardians. We are chilling. We are mad chilling right now. Attack into this bad boy. It's 2,400. Okay, he gets to draw. The, okay, he only has three cards, so there's no way he could win either way. We're going to go ahead and attack again. 4,500. And then end it off. Oh, yeah. 5,000 to the freaking face, dude. This thing is so satisfying because it's so easy. It's so simple, but it's very effective. So let's hop right in to the next one. And for our fourth match, yet again, going second like we want to. So losing the dice roll, I mean, the coin flip isn't necessarily a bad thing. Oh, oh, okay. The blue eyes. Okay. I do. I want to build the blue eyes deck so bad, but you are missing so many. And basically, I'm going to cry because I have so many decks I want to build, but I'm, I'm not able to. Okay. Gets a whole bunch of cards out. Cool. We got the Nobleman arms, so we're chilling right now. The power of the Guardians. Oh, yeah. We're going to Magical Mallet, one of the Ben Keys, and the Imperm. Just see what else we could get. Oh, no way. Okay. Axe of Despair. Power of the Guardians. And another Power of the Guardians, which is one of the most broken cards to equip Ben Key with. Okay, we're gonna go ahead, pay the 500 to attack him directly, and every turn we're just gonna buff our dude another thousand. So we're gonna take that. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay, and then we're gonna attack yet again. Let's keep it going. Another thousand. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Of course. Let's attack him to the face. And another thousand. Why not? I mean, yeah, I can finish him off, but what's the fun in that? We're going to go ahead and end them off with 4,500. Oh, yeah. Straight to the freaking face. Ooh. Gotta love that. OTK for the win. Very effective, honestly. And a lot of cards don't negate it because there's not all those synchros, exceeds, fusion, monsters that negate. It's amazing. So let's hop right in to the last match. And for our last match. Oh, yeah. You already know. We are going second. And we have... A pretty beastly hand here. And he has one face down monster. Sick. And we got the nobleman, so like, oh. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, mage power. Okay. Another mage power. Okay. Noble arms. Then we'll face down and the imperm. Just just to be cheeky. <laughs> he surrenders. He already knows what the heck is going on. He knows. I get two attacks. Attack him straight directly to the face. And GG's. Super easy. Oh, man. Honestly, the first time I went up against this deck in an event, I was like, what the heck is that? I knew I had to build it. It's so simple, and it works very well. So, I hope you all enjoyed that. Let me know what you guys are using in the new event. But, if you guys don't know yet, we do have a Discord for the community, so make sure to join that. We had an awesome stream today, and honestly, the whole community came out. We had about several different people dueling it at once, and then I showcased a whole bunch of the matches. It was super fun. Everybody hung out for about two hours, and then people stayed afterwards. And overall, we had a blast. Make sure to join the Discord in the description if you guys want to be a part of that. Also, we're going to have sub battles on the channel every Thursday. So, again, make sure to join the Discord. But I hope you all enjoy, and I'll catch everybody on the next one. Peace.